Hello YouTubers and welcome to my first ever audio commentary on one of my uh, videos. So uh, this is my Five Nights at Freddy's 2 review. And you can see here this is actually filmed at night in my back garden. Uh, if you look, if you actually look though, there's someone I want to talk about first. Uh, that there's two versions of this. There's uh, the full version, which is the one I'm uh, commentating on now. But there's also uh, because of YouTube having a bit of a mess up um, with the 15 minute sort of thing. Uh, I had to split it into two parts initially until I managed to fix the problem. By the way, yeah, it's the full version. 10 days of job hunting later, hooray. <laughs> a very, very basic effect. Uh, I actually uh, edited this entire video uh, on my tablet uh, because my laptop unfortunately keeps crashing and uh, I didn't realise that it was actually cut, the camera was actually cutting my head off because I couldn't actually see it because uh, I didn't have anyone to film this with, unfortunately. Oh dear, you're gonna die. I'm gonna fucking die! And now we cut uh, to my bedroom. Uh, I decided to um, do this video in my bedroom because there were so many issues last time doing it in my living room because the reason why the camera keeps turning there's all them quick edits and shots and that is because uh, my dog was actually in the room at the time running around. And unfortunately, it wasn't the best time. It was the only time I could film it, though, in the living room. Uh, because I realised I did need a big amount of space if I wanted uh, to do this whole thing. But I decided I'll do it from the desk. And that's since I can use my actual desk for this one, which makes a bit more sense. And there's my uh, prank little torch, which I am shining. Dear, dear. And uh, the reason I'm um, wearing a Family Guy t-shirt, uh, I wore it in uh, my Christmas video of 2014. Uh, unfortunately, I couldn't... My normal uh, shirt was in the washing. I wanted to get this video out because I'd previously been ill and it was just taking forever. So I guess I thought I'd make up an excuse uh, so, to the reason why in the shirt, and I think, well, I'm poor, aren't I? <laughs> because uh, I could, I lost my job for some reason, or oh, I died on the job and survived miraculously somehow. So that's why I'm still here. So I'm in a bit of a stretch, and I'm gonna look around. And uh, originally, I was going to edit Foxy into this. Um, unfortunately, um, the animation on that won't exactly work to my favour. So it's just all in one take. It's all in one take. It saves editing because, believe me, uh, this video, which is mm, 20 minutes long, was originally uh, my yeah, first took all the footage together yeah, that was uh, I think about 40 minutes long so a lot of it's being cut from the original thing you'll be glad to hear oh no oh, something's coming it's going to get me why is it gonna get me <laughs> exactly that's a great excuse why are you sitting there go 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 oh dear no way. Uh, no, the thing is here, you'll see in a minute, that I actually put my thumb on the screen, unfortunately, which is not the thing I wanted to do because uh, because my laptop is broken. I wanted to do, to show the PC version this time around. But unfortunately, since my laptop still isn't working, I can't. Uh, but there I am acting all scared. There goes Foxy. <laughs> <clears throat> but there it is, there it all happened. Da -da -da. 
And there's that picture of a van me <laughs> pretending to be sort of Freddy. And then we go back and uh, the full lights on. Makes me actually hurt reviewing the whole thing. I had uh, several ideas of how I was going to do this. So actually, uh, I was going to do it as uh, a backdrop and have sort of um, using uh, cloth, a black cloth, sort of cover the back so it's all black. Unfortunately, it won't cover the whole thing. So I just thought, he the hell with this, I'll just do my blind because in the in the dark you won't you can't really see much color even though it isn't as dark as the last one it's still pretty dark it was lit with just uh, a single lamp at an angle to give a great uh, dark atmosphere but not too dark because obviously the second game it, things have been lit up a bit oh dear oh well let's go with this one wobble That's a, that's a little sneaky way I edit these together so I can press stop on the camera. So essentially, when you boot up this game, hey, look at that. It's and it is well done, it is. In most ways, and... So I see this is me on my tablet and that, and yeah, I, I didn't adjust the brightness, unfortunately, uh, before doing this, so that's why everything looks so crisp and bright and reflective. And you can actually see... Uh, my phone, which is actually yeah, recording this, so the just reflected in the screen. To the first game in most ways. However, this but uh, just so you know, people, people are saying, oh, this is cheap, cheap and that, uh, no, no, no. Just, just to let you know, I am just one guy. I'm just one guy um, who's 16 years old and who's doing GCSEs and that all at the time, who's also being ill and that, and I'm, I've done it. I've done it, and it's, it, this is, these... This video, um, and the, the last Five Nights at Freddy's, much harder. my god, they, they take forever to make. They, these seriously take forever to make. So uh, just keep that in mind. That, and I do put a lot of effort trying to just get it out there and finishing it. To give you an example, my three year anniversary. You think, well, uh, this you you this was there, just man. as hard to make as that. Maybe is, even harder, I don't know. Because uh, with my 50th... 50th? With my thir three anniversary anyway. special, I had my friend Matthew um, there when I was filming on location to actually uh, record on that. Uh, I did all the editing and that myself, um, but at least I had him there for the location work, which really saved a lot of time. Here, though, I've only got me. I have to record the stuff outside and that. I record all the stuff inside. I have to edit it. And that I have to cook a lot of stuff, so I'm all on my own for this. Yes, you have to keep winding up the music box. Good valid point. No. Not run out in this game. But this video, just so you know, I was originally going to make it uh, ages ago. Actually, uh, I was planning for uh, either a Christmas, a Christmas Day release, or a New Year's Day release. Unfortunately, neither of those things actually happened. And it's now you can go and read it if you like. um, January the 6th. This was actually meant to come out on January the 5th. But unfortunately, due to YouTube being annoying and the accents, uh, we know of all them modern day YouTube issues. Uh, it's a day late again. But it is out, and I'm proud to have it out. I do work hard at these. And obviously, I will be doing a Five Nights at Freddy's review as well. Uh, but anyway, I, I hope you like these commentaries. I'm just, I'm watching this as I'm talking and I'm just trying to think of what I talk because I'm actually reviewing something. But I also plan to do uh, a one for my three year anniversary. Hopefully, I might get my friend Matthew to do uh, commentary on that as well since he's in it. Not that much, though. He's in it not that much. And then there's obviously the four year anniversary. Uh, which, he has a sneak little hint, 
Um, my, my friend Matthew, who was in my last one, uh, is leaving. He, because uh, I said I was originally going to do a series, and uh, he decided to leave. And that, and uh, the person who was going to replace him decided to quit as well. And a lot of people just weren't on board with it and just kept leaving it, thinking that it would all magically just come together. And it doesn't, unfortunately, doesn't. So I had to cancel that series, which is unfortunate. So, and the only episode film from the series was uh, the first episode, uh, which is called After the Attack, and that's where he leaves. So, that's going to be my four-year anniversary. So there we go, all the custom night modes. Um, I haven't uh, managed to... Gung Freddy is an extremely difficult mode where Gung Freddy just won't leave you the fuck alone, which is annoying. In, um, the thing is with Gung Fei is he was an Easter egg in the first game, but he's not. He's not in that game, which unfortunately. He's, and uh, I don't think anyone's made this point. I didn't make this point in the review, but I might as well make it now. That uh, Gung Freddy in the first game has a blue hat and a blue bow tie, but in the second game he has a black top hat and a black bow tie just like freddy now obviously it is a different animal try this one's damaged where the first one wasn't and it looks like there's an actual en enzo skeleton in there Exoskeleton. can't talk which is different and yes yeah, so a check can you actually see that i have no idea if you could and you can't really and uh, also, these videos are filmed actually in 1080p. They're filmed in full HD. However, um, when editing them and that, and when uploading to YouTube, I actually downscale them to 720p. Uh, mainly just because it takes forever to upload them now. But it's not just that while I'm uploading the video to YouTube, if I'm going to watch other YouTube videos or go on BBC iPlayer or something else, anything on the internet, it slows everything else uh, down. Because bear in mind, it's not like I'm just living on my own in this house. That There are five other people, uh, well, four other people living in this house who are all using the broadband at the same time. What? Which means, you know, uh, that makes it go even slower. I was considering at one point to make all my videos 4K, but after that uh, five-minute video, which is 1.7 gigabytes for a five-minute 4K video, I decided I'm scratching that. I don't care. It just took too long. And uh, that bit there, you can hear um, my sister screaming in, that, in the back, so I quickly... Um, jumped through a few of my notes which I made on this and uh, I forget where actually the camera is I keep looking that way because um, some of my notes are on there but unfortunately I lost some of my notes and I just forgot them um, because in these reviews and these especially the game reviews and that I make key notes uh, for something I'm going to talk about, so I can actually uh, remember what I'm actually going to say. I also, since it is a game review, I tried to take a different approach to this. Uh, my doc reviews and that are, you know, very serious and there's no, like, silliness and that. But in this one, uh, I guess I, I, I try to make them a bit more entertaining and that because, obviously, this is more mainstream and that. It's a game... It's a very popular game in the ga the gaming industry on YouTube. That is just so big, uh, so to even get a slight notice, I don't expect it to go big or anything. And that I I know it won't. But even get a slight little glance, you know, you gotta do something to actually uh, get yourself out there. I have no idea what I'm actually being saying at this point because I'm being too busy talking. What have I been saying? Oh, yes, the back. Mm. I'm actually gla glad that this actually, the second game actually 
does uh, take you a little bit more into the backstory, though, actually, the games themselves, they don't tell you much at all about the backstory. They, they just give you little hints, and hints become theories, and uh, the most popular ones are going into the backstory. There's very little official backstory. There is this... There is tiny little bits in the backstory. Yeah. In, no, there's nothing confirmed. I don't know if Scott Kaufman will ever actually confirm this. I doubt he will. He'll just and uh, part of me says, well, he shouldn't because you know it allows people to come up with all these theories and that and how to their own interpretation. But then again, part of me does because um, then you know it's official and we can't argue. Like, this is this, this is that. It's like, no, this is it, this is it. I'd like him really, I'd like him to sort of like 50 50, like, give us a little bit more. At the moment, we've got nothing, next to nothing. This may all be resolved in the third game. Uh, I've seen the little um, teaser for the third game, that little picture of the Golden Freddy, or is it Golden Foxy, or. Or is it, what the hell is it? I don't know. Maybe it's. Who knows? Maybe it's a new golden thing altogether. I, I don't know. Because the head, the head, and I'm just listening to sound, the head <coughs> looks more like Gunfei, even though there was that flipped over image. It does look more like Gunfei, the head, but the teeth look like Foxy. Maybe it's just a weird uh, hybrid where they're both sort of mashed together, like the view sculpt. Parts of these like Gung Freddy's head and Foxy's teeth, who knows? I'm discussing this now because it's, well, the best time to discuss it. And yes, the old animatronics are in this, though they're not really old, old. They're not the old animatronics from the first game, they're from the uh, Fazbear Dino, or whatever it was called. I can't remember the name. Give me a break, I'm not actually reviewing this, I'm actually watching this. Uh, exactly. Actually, uh, we could play a little game here. Spot all the things that are in the background in my videos. Uh, the, the, oh, look, there's a dressing gown on the ladders. My bed. There's some jeans. Uh, the left, my curtains. A little robe. Someday I'm probably I'm probably going to do a death montage. Uh, because I've died, I've been dying quite a lot in my videos, to be honest. Um, I died uh, in my th three anniversary. I died in both Five Nights at Freddy's videos. Uh, I died at the beginning of my um, 13 inch RC Dalek review. Um, uh, I, I didn't die in my Hall review, although I did run out screaming. Um, on actual life in the video, I mean. This game. What else could I die in? I don't know. It's probably enough to make a death montage anyway. It'd be, be pretty funny. Who knows? I may do that um, for my uh, four year anniversary as well. Uh, but I want to make it bigger and better. And uh, even though this review and that, it's not. Oh god, it's nowhere near perfect. And if I had unlimited time in that. I'll polish it off, but then you probably not get this review for ages. Because uh, if I was making it immaculate and perfect, you probably wouldn't get it until the end of this year, to be honest. I had to really, really, really push to try and get this done. The actual review in the game itself is actually the easiest bit. Works that bit at the beginning, but it's just to do something different and something new. But. All uh, but I try to make each one better, and it's my own opinion here what I'm saying, but I, I'm saying that uh, this second review, I think it's a massive improvement over the first one, in my opinion. In my opinion, but I've definitely, I have definitely worked harder on this one. I'm not saying I didn't work hard on the first one. I worked extremely hard on the first one. But uh, I, I took the criticisms and that, that I had with it. Uh, but... And I tried to work on it, so no longer am I using a monopod to film this, I'm using my trusty old tripod 
to film this uh, review. Which is a bit, a little bit more tricky, uh, just because the legs are so big in that, and it's hard to actually maneuver it. Buying, I had to move my desk and everything around. Yes, you should. That'll be next video. I actually, I actually um, did actually try to get a friend and that to do this. Uh, unfortunately, no one would.